In this year's World Indoor Track and Field Championships, spectators were treated to an extraordinary display of athleticism and determination, particularly in the men's races. Among the standout performances, one that truly captured the essence of elite running was witnessed in the men's 1500 meters event. As the race unfolded, it became evident that history was in the making. Jordi Beamish, representing New Zealand, emerged as an unlikely protagonist in a narrative that would captivate the audience. Positioned in eighth place as the runners entered the final lap, Beamish seemed to defy the laws of physics as he embarked on a breathtaking surge to the front of the pack. With each stride, Beamish closed the gap between himself and the leaders with astonishing speed, reminiscent of a freight train hurtling towards its destination. His acceleration was relentless, his determination palpable. As he navigated the final stretch of the race, Bemis executed a maneuver that can only be described as slingshotting, propelling himself past his competitors with a burst of energy that left spectators in awe. Among those left in his wake was Cole Hawker, a formidable contender from the United States known for his formidable finishing kick. Yet even Hawker could not withstand the sheer force of Beamish's charge. In a dramatic turn of events, Beamish crossed the finish line in first place, securing the gold medal by a margin of more than a tenth of a second. The significance of Beamish's victory extended far beyond mere triumph on the track. It was a testament to the indomitable spirit of the human athlete, to the capacity for greatness that lies within each individual. Beamish's performance defied conventional wisdom, challenging the notion of what was deemed possible in the realm of indoor running. For those fortunate enough to witness it, Beamish's final lap was not merely a display of speed, but a masterclass in strategic racing. His ability to navigate through the field with precision and finesse showcased a level of tactical acumen rarely seen in the sport. It was a performance that left an indelible mark on the annals of indoor running history. In the aftermath of his victory, Bemis's name would be etched alongside the legends of the sport. He had proven himself to be more than just a runner. He was a pioneer, a trailblazer who had shattered the barriers of what was thought possible. His final lap time of 26 11 seconds stood as a testament to his unrivaled skill and determination. Yet, amidst the euphoria surrounding Beamish's historic victory, another contender was quietly making his mark on the world stage. Josh Kerr, hailing from Great Britain, had long been regarded as one of the most promising talents in the sport. His performances in previous competitions, including the Tokyo Olympics and the World Championships in Budapest, had cemented his reputation as a force to be reckoned with. However, it was Kerr's performance in this year's World Indoor Championships that would elevate him to legendary status. Competing in the 3,000 meters event, a distance twice that of his usual specialty, Kerr faced a formidable challenge. Yet armed with confidence born from recent successes, including a world record in the two-mile race, Kerr approached the competition with unwavering determination. As the race unfolded, Kerr found himself locked in a battle with Selimun Berega, an Olympic champion from Ethiopia with an impressive pedigree in distance running. Despite Berega's formidable reputation, Kerr refused to be intimidated. With each stride, he asserted his dominance, gradually pulling away from his rival with a display of speed and endurance that bordered on the miraculous. In a moment that will be etched into the annals of sporting history, Kerr unleashed a final sprint that left spectators breathless. With just 200 meters remaining, he surged ahead with a ferocity that belied the grueling nature of the race. His speed was unmatched, his determination unwavering. As he crossed the finish line, Kerr's final lap time of 25.19 seconds sent shockwaves through the arena, establishing a new benchmark for excellence in indoor running. For Kerr, the significance of his victory extended far beyond the confines of the track. It was a statement of intent, a declaration of his arrival on the world stage. His performance in the 3000 meters event showcased not only his physical prowess, 
but also his mental fortitude, his ability to overcome adversity and emerge victorious against the odds. As the dust settled on the World Indoor Championships, Kerr's name would be spoken of in hushed tones, whispered in reverence by those who had witnessed his greatness. Yet, amidst the adulation and acclaim, Kerr remained humble, his focus firmly fixed on the challenges that lay ahead. For Kerr, the road to greatness had been long and arduous, marked by setbacks and challenges that would have deterred lesser men. Yet, through sheer determination and unwavering dedication, he had emerged victorious, his name forever etched into the annals of sporting history. As the world looked ahead to the Paris Olympics, the question on everyone's lips was clear. Could Kerr replicate his success on the grandest stage of them all? The answer, it seemed, lay in the hands of destiny, a tantalizing prospect that left fans and pundits alike eagerly awaiting the next chapter in Kerr's remarkable journey. In the meantime, the world of track and field was left to ponder the implications of Kerr's historic victory. For some, it was a sign of things to come, a harbinger of a new era of dominance in the sport. For others, it was a reminder of the enduring power of the human spirit, a testament to the boundless potential that lies within each and every one of us. As the curtain fell on another unforgettable chapter in the annals of indoor running, one thing was abundantly clear. The legacy of Josh Kerr and Jordy Beamish would endure for generations to come, their names forever synonymous with greatness, their achievements forever etched into the fabric of sporting history. Thank you for tuning in, and until next time on Discovering Hub Sports, where the thrill of the track unfolds and narratives of resilience, rivalry, and triumph continue to captivate. Kindly stay informed, share your thoughts, and don't forget to subscribe.